Hi friends, this is Vincent. I would like to give you a little tips about organic compounds and their functional groups and how they are going to affect the entire properties of a parent compound. So when we are discussing the functional groups First, we go to the definition of functional group. What is meant by the functional groups? Functional groups are an atom, a group of atom that attached to a parent hydrocarbon are capable for entire physical and chemical properties of that compound. So, once a hydroxyl group attached to parent hydrocarbon entire properties of that compound can be directed by that a specific group or atom. That kind of group or atom is known as functional groups. For example, as we know, the halogens, chlorine, bromine, iodine, or aldehyde groups, CHO group, or carboxylic acid group or hydroxyl group are the most common function groups we are used to familiar with in organic chemistry. As we know, haloalkane, for example, I'm taking example as ethyl chloride. That means CH3CH3, CH3, that is known as ethane, this parent alkane. From ethane, we can make ethyl chloride. So the properties of the parent compound changes due to attachment of that particular halogen atom. Similarly, ethanol, CH3CH2OH. So when we consider ethane and ethanol, the properties like, physical properties like boiling points or the solubility or kind of chemical reactions or also varied with the hydroxyl group. So you know the hydroxyl group, the oxygen and hydrogen attached to a main carbon atom of a parent compound. Because of that polarity difference between oxygen and hydrogen atom in hydroxyl group that helps the at alcohol to mix with the polar solvents like water. So in this context we will be familiar with the word hydrogen bonding. Hydrogen bond is a, a weak bond of formation between delta positive so hydrogen bond is a, a weak bond of formation that originates from the polarity developed in oxygen and hydrogen atoms. Because of the electronegativity differences, the bonding pair of electron in between oxygen and hydrogen atom would be more shifted into oxygen atom because of high electronegativity of that oxygen atom. As a result of that, oxygen will get delta negative charge and hydrogen will get delta positive charge. 
because of this dipolarity or dipo dipolar formation this will helps to attack or attract the opposite charged species for example in alcohol as we know the hydroxyl group the same story in oxygen atom has the because of the polarity difference oxygen would get slight negative charge and hydrogen would get slight positive charge and that will help to attract the positive part of the hydroxyl group of alcohol with the negative part of water molecule because of the polarity of the water this kind of association helps increase in boiling point of alcohol the same situation also we can analyze in the case of aldehydes and our carboxylic acids in aldehydes we know there is a c double bond or ch group that means c double bond or group is more unstable or more more reactive because of the pi electrons pi bonds the same as in carboxylic acid so that that coo group is known as a carbonyl group there will be a chance of formation of same dipole formation or the electro negativity difference or the polar formation that could result in the formation of a delta positive charge on the carbon atom and delta negative charge on the oxygen atom and this will help to attract or react with the, the polar solvents like water because of the uh, the ionic a slight ionic charge formation on the water molecule uh, this kind of association helps this kind the, the, these above said molecules for example aldehydes alcohols carboxylic acid have a generally higher boiling points than their corresponding parent compounds thank you for watching this i hope so i see you again with another topics that will help you in your preparation for the exam I hope you enjoyed this small video and if you liked please don't forget to click the like button and please to also subscribe my videos so you would be able to know when I upload my next video. Thank you.